guys, it's Juvie and welcome back to my channel. So I know we're in a different environment right now. It's because I'm actually back in my hometown. So I'm back in my parents' house for like a few weeks until school starts again. Probably next week my environment's gonna change again because I'm gonna be moving back to college. Yeah, my studies gonna be switching up, so I just thought I should adjust that. So for today's video, I'm gonna be playing with the new Zodiac palette by ColourPop, and this is a collaboration with Kathleen Lights, one of my favorite makeup gurus ever. And this palette is super beautiful. I placed this mat here. I like made this little thing. It's actually really easy. Like it's just basically duct tape flopped on there, but I did that so it doesn't mess up the mirror. But anyways. These colors are super beautiful and each eyeshadow has a different zodiac sign and so me, I'm this one, I'm Aquarius, just like Kathleen Lights. So for my makeup look today, I was thinking of just doing all the air signs, but I did cheat a little bit and went into Taurus, so hopefully you don't mind that. I just wanted to deepen the crease a bit, but for the most part I use all the air signs and they're super beautiful. Gemini is probably like the most foiled shimmer I've ever seen in my life, so I freaking love that color. Even though Geminis aren't the best people in the world. I mean, if you're a Gemini, sorry, but most, like, 90% of the Geminis I met, mm, my older brother is a Gemini, so, mm. And not only did I get this, I also got the Dream Street palette, so expect some tours with this, because both of them had, like, a bundle together, and I've been wanting this palette forever, so I was like, two for one, I'm gonna get it, duh. So if you want to see the makeup look I'm gonna create today, then just keep watching. First things first, you want to start it off with priming those eyelids, and I use my usual NYX Full Coverage Concealer. The first air sign I go into is Libra, and this is a really pretty satin light pink, and all I do is just blend that into my crease and just really buff it out. Next, I go into Taurus and I use a pointed blending brush so that I can just really focus this in the crease because I feel like Libra was a little too light so I wanted a little more definition. And then I take my fluffy blending brush again just buff those two colors together. Now this is where things get interesting. I go into Aquarius, which is this really pretty cobalt blue, and I go in with a dense brush, and this is where I basically try to wing my eyeshadow. It is pretty difficult to wing this eyeshadow, that's why I use a dense brush, because it really helps me guide my way into drawing it, but you're welcome to use an angled brush, I just find it easier with a dense brush. And you want to keep going back and forth from the palette to your eye because it's not very pigmented on first contact so you just really want to build the color. And I take an Aquarius into the middle of my eye because that's where I'll be blended in with the next eyeshadow. Now for the last air sign, I go into Gemini which is this beautiful super foiled gold color. I basically just trace it along my crease and then fill in the areas in the front part of my eye and then just bring it in towards the blue. And then I clean that brush off so then I can really blend the two colors together. Now I go back into Aquarius so then I can build that blue again. Now you got this cool air sign eyelid look going on. To press record but while I was off camera I did my eyeliner and I also did my face off camera just so you let you know again uh, but yeah just a wing liner got it okay back to voiceover now to finish off the eye look I go in with a Libra again and take it onto a smudge brush to really buff it into my lower lash line next I go into Taurus and do the exact same thing 
Lastly, I go into Aquarius and buff that really close to my lower lash line, kind of like it look like there's like blue eyeliner under my eye. Now I just curl my lashes and get them ready for some mascara. The first mascara I go in is the L'Oreal Lash Paradise and I just put this on my top and bottom lashes. Next I go in with Maybelline's Colossal Big Shot Mascara and I only coat my top lashes with this. For blush, I go into the Zodiac palette again and use Libra and take it on a fluffy brush and place it on my cheeks. I saw Kathleen Lights do this on a video, or at least she talked about it, and I thought it was really pretty and it leaves a really nice pink tint to my cheeks. Still with the Zodiac palette, I go into Cancer and use this to highlight the inner corners of my eyes. After that, I just set my face and I fan it away. With Cancer again, I take it on a highlighting brush and use this to highlight my cheeks. And this is super pretty and it's like not glittery whatsoever. Lastly, I go with my new Luxe lipsticks from ColourPop in the color layover. And let me tell you, the formula on these lipsticks are amazing. They're super creamy and they feel so hydrating. Like, I never felt anything like it. And this color is like my perfect nude. And I never thought I would ever find my perfect nude. And that is the final look. Thank you guys for watching. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, then subscribe to my channel. So I hope you guys try this look out and I'll see you in my next video.